this album is called The Way In because for me and I think for most people, music is a gateway into a beautiful place of listening, connecting, and just being in the moment. The core trio on this album is Robbie Botosh on piano and keyboards, Ted Quinlan on a bunch of guitars, and myself on bass. Uh, we have been playing together for many years. We have a really deep musical connection. We also brought in two guest percussionists, Joaquin Nunes and Davide Dorenzo, and super happy to have Andrew Mullen mix and record this album. trios anymore and that's a really good thing to keep alive I would say because some of some of the greatest albums were recorded like guitar piano and bass and different formations but this also has a unique spin on it with the percussion and just adding sounds or you know doubling on some keyboards or whatever it is so it's very untraditional but it's very traditional at the same time so that's really great Ted brings beautiful colors and textures to all of the tracks. I, I mean, for me, playing the different guitars, I mean, that's kind of where I live. You know, that, that's my, my wheelhouse. Um, obviously, it's the electric guitar, and I love the fact that it's the electric guitar. I'd love to take full advantage of it, and love that the music lent itself so well to that in terms of using different kinds of tones, everything from closer to a jazz guitar type sound to some more overtly rock guitar sounds and then various ambient sounds going on on the different tracks. And I love playing acoustic guitar too, so it was great to get to do that in a couple of tunes. Joaquin brings such a great energy and vibe, and he plays on Gratitude and Bath Nights on this album. To come in and play, uh, try to, to incorporate percussion into what is already happening, uh, it, was a, it was a little bit of a challenge, um, but I was very excited about, about the opportunity to do so. Uh, always is a good day when you are playing, you know, with, with Mike Down and, and Robbie Botosh and, and Ted. It's, it's always a good day. Davide brought some beautiful and subtle percussion parts to Monumental, Crimson, and Seriously, or as we like to call it, Seriously. Of, of, of having such a relationship with these people is that you you know you get to know them um, as humans uh, rather than you know people that you just play with you get to know them after a while and it, it deepens the musical experience as well sometimes mixing can be just this very sort of technical mechanical sort of thing and I felt more like you know I listened to the way in or monumental or something like that and it like it's it's you know it's a it conjures a lot of extra musical things I think that I really enjoyed, even in the mixing process, and that feeds back into the mixing process. I really wanted to explore all the colors and textures we could get with this trio and the guest percussionists, and I'm really proud of what this album became. So I hope the music takes you in.